guys and welcome back to another review. So we are doing one from Buxom today and this is the Lash Mascara in Blackest Black. This is a sample size. Full size is obviously the size of like a normal mascara. Full size is $25. So we will be using the sample size I got from Ipsy or wherever I got this from. I think I got it from Ipsy. So the wand looks like, oh, it's like a nice big old wand on there. Look at that. Oh, I'm excited to see how this performs. Why am I smelling it? Also, why does it have a smell? Like, it kind of smells like paint. <laughs> but also just like, you know, mascara. So, I was like, I don't know why I do that by default. But I do that with like all the makeup. Why do I always smell? I don't know. I always smell the things. So, we're going to go on in. Put this on carefully. Already, it is lengthening really nicely, and it's not clumping, which is, again, really, really, really nice. I don't have to fight with this at all. I'm just, like, pushing them up and up and up, and it just keeps going. This is great. I'm, like, wiggling at the base of the lashes just to get a little more fullness going in there, but oh my gosh, this is really good. As far as I know, this one is not waterproof. They probably make a waterproof one, but just as whatever version I got, I don't think it probably is since it doesn't mention it. I mean, you're watching how much I'm coating on there and it is not clumping. I'm just going up, 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 up. Holy shit. And I just show you guys the difference, like, let me move that so I don't get it in my hair, but, guys, really, that is amazing. Let's do that on the other side, dude. <laughs> I'm just, like, mind blown at this. Okay, I'm trying to shuffle carefully here and not drop anything. All right. This is always the trickier side, since this is the side where my lashes naturally are straighter. And it takes a lot more effort to get them to look long and luscious and everything, and to get the curl to stay, so we'll see. We'll see what happens, because I'm curious to see what it does here. But given how well it worked on the first side, I have high expectations, not gonna lie. Wow. Come on, stay up. You know you want to. You know you want to. I mean, this is a lot closer than I usually get with this side. Just saying. Just saying. This is pretty great. I'm trying to get those little inner corner lashes to play nice too. They are just like, ha, no. <laughs> We're just gonna stick to what's next to us and call it a day. I'm like, no, 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 no. You need to go up too and look all nice and pretty. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. And they're like, no, no, we really can't. Can't be bothered. That middle part does not want to stay up. <laughs> like I said, this side does not like to stay curled as well. So I'm trying the lift and twirl method right now, but I don't know if it'll work. So I'm giving it every opportunity to just do the thing. Anyway, I will show you what it did do, though. So, this is how we're looking now. Either way, it is noticeably different. Even if it's not perfectly symmetrical, since, again, this side just stays straighter. And that was with curling the lashes with a curler before I started. I mean, that's not bad. I am still pretty damn happy with that. 
Now, are they volumized? No. But if you're going into this for a length and not necessarily volume, this is lovely. And honestly, personally, I tend to prefer length over, volu over volume. So for me, this is great. I give this a five out of five. Like literally, this is just incredible. I feel like I would definitely consider paying 25 bucks for this. At least I say that today. We'll see how I feel when I reach the end of the tube, because I might change my mind by then. Sometimes I do. Sometimes I do. But as of right now, as of this moment, I feel like, you know what, I would, I would buy that. I would buy that. This works great. <laughs> like, I'm very impressed with it and very happy. So anyway, if you've never tried this one before, highly recommend it. Then again, have I ever been disappointed by Buxom yet? No. So anyways, those are my thoughts. So anyway, you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my eBay, my Reddits, everything and more. It's all down below. And if you like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. Anyway, guys, till next time, see ya.